Welcome back to the breakfast show too. I'm here with Liz Haynes from Old Town Cape, which is set to host a couple events for this holiday weekend. Good morning. How are you doing? Good morning. I'm great. Thanks Good. so much for having me. Today. Yes. All right. So tell us a little bit about the Christmas tree lighting that is taking place on Friday, correct? Yes, we are so excited. This is our official kickoff in our downtown yes. area of the holiday season. So it's always a very festive event and it will be taking place on Basterling Suites Courtyard there at the corner of Broadway and Fountain and and um, at 5 p.m. we will have all kinds of different vendors, food trucks, all kinds of um, treats and food. Uh -huh. And we will have fire pits and s'mores. Oh uh, word on the street is Santa will be making an appearance, Santa and Mrs. Claus, and maybe even some elves oh my around 6 p.m. And then there will be a countdown to officially light the tree around 6.20. Oh my gosh, it sounds like it's so special. I know that when like last year and previous years driving down uh, Broadway and just seeing the tree, it, it warms your heart. It, really it, just, it does. makes you feel like Christmas is really here. And so what makes Absolutely. that event so special for you guys? You know, it's so special because this is the fourth annual and it just continues to grow mm -hmm. in popularity every year. Mm -hmm. And we can kind of keep tweaking it and adding to yep. it to make it the most festive, um, just best opportunity for people to come together, mm -hmm. come downtown, enjoy everything our downtown has to offer and kick off the holiday season officially. Oh, yeah, I mean, that is the perfect way to kick off the holiday season and there's no charge to you know participate in right. the tree lighting you Absolutely. just show up and watch the tree that's right have your bellies hungry yes there's all kinds of treats to offer oh my gosh that will be so much fun and then that's not the only thing going on in cape this weekend we also have the parade of lights that sunday tell us a little bit about that that's right so this event has been going on for decades. Mm -hmm. This event um, starts at Kappa Hall Park, goes down Broadway, turns right on Main and will end at the Hudson's parking lot. This Sunday at dusk is when it all starts. Uh -huh. um, this year's theme is a very merry Grinchmas. Oh, so goodness. such a fun. I'm sure there will be lots of Grinches oh, to yes. see. And of course all of the floats are all decked out in holiday mm -hmm. lights. So it's such a fun, fun evening for our whole community, our whole region. People yeah. come from all over the region. Mm -hmm. And I guess event that this is just another event that really gets people into the spirit of the holidays and really, I guess, brings the community together. Talk a little bit about how these events bring the community really together. Does. Absolutely, that's really what Old Town Cape is all about. Mm -hmm. We are all about downtown revitalization. Uh, we do 55 events a year, Holy and cow. the idea of all of those events is to get people to come to mm -hmm. our downtown, you know, enjoy everything it has to offer, grab a coffee at one of our wonderful coffee shops, yep. grab dinner at a, a fabulous restaurant, mm -hmm. and enjoy, you know, some celebrating the season with the rest of the community. Yeah, and so I could imagine that there's a lot that goes into planning these events. Absolutely. Talk a little bit about what does it take to get to get ready for these events? Yes, yeah, so well, we could not do it with all of our amazing volunteers, mm -hmm. I will say. We are yep. a very volunteer-driven organization. Um, we have chairs for all of our events, so wonderful volunteers that um, dedicate their time uh -huh. and energy to helping us bring these events to fruition. And then, of course, I have a team. Uh, we have a fabulous event coordinator. We have a content coordinator that helps get the word out about yep. all of these events. Um, it really takes a village. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, we rely on the community to come enjoy the events yeah. as well and yeah. support our downtown businesses while they're at it, too. For sure. And so then you said you guys have 55 events that you guys do. Are these maybe one of the bigger events out of the year for you guys? Yes, yes. Our holiday events are really the most yeah. fun. We always look forward to our holiday events because mm -hmm. there's so many. Yes. Everybody's in, you know, joyful, uh, up, uplifting spirits. Uh -huh. um, so it's really, really great to see just people enjoying our downtown. Um, we also do the Cape Farmers Market. That's also a really popular big uh -huh. event as well. Um, Tunes at Twilight. So we do a lot of events that are very, um, you know, well loved community yeah. events that people, you know, really just have as part of their ongoing routines. So oh, yeah. Exciting to and see. And so then just a reminder, Friday starts at what time? What time should people get down there? Uh, Friday at 5 p.m. is when the uh, food trucks will be open and ready for, for folks and the, the fire pits will be going for cool. s'mores as well. And so then Friday is the Christmas tree lighting and that's over at Vasterling Suite right. on their courtyard. Yep. And then what time does the parade start on Sunday. Parade starts at dusk, at dark, okay. so around five-ish. Okay, yeah. so people, I guess, should get there maybe a little bit before yep, so they can up, get their spots. Get their spots, absolutely. Awesome. Absolutely. Well, it sounds like it's just going to be such a fun weekend. I know that I'm looking forward to it. I've never been to the Parade of Lights before, oh, so I have gosh. to check it out. Absolutely, I think. check I've, it out. Yes, I've only heard great things about it. So if you guys need something to do this weekend, definitely check out the Christmas tree lighting or even the Parade of Lights. Go to both of them. It's going to be such a great weekend. Liz, thank you so much for joining us Thank this you morning. So much. We'll be back here shortly.